Socialist leader and acting Prime Minister Pedro Sanchez said it's a deal for four years. He signed a pact today alongside Podemos leader Pablo Iglesias. The unexpectedly fast preliminary agreement would require further steps to be workable, including bringing in smaller parties and agreeing on who gets what position in the cabinet. If confirmed, it would be Spain's first coalition government since the country's return to democracy in the late 1970s. Mr. Sanchez said Spain needs a stable government, adding that the deal was open to others. The combination of the 120 seats obtained by the socialists and the 35 of Unidas Podemos falls short of a majority in the 350-seat parliament. The socialists and Podemos had tried and failed to strike a government deal after the April election, which prompted Mr. Sanchez to call the repeat ballot. The two men had been at odds for months and exchanged harsh words as acrimonious talks failed after the April election. Today, though, they were all smiles, even hugging after they signed the agreement. Mr. Iglesias said it was a preliminary agreement to create a progressive coalition government in Spain, which combines the experience of PSOE with the courage of Unidas Podemos. Spanish media said that Mr. Iglesias would be made deputy prime minister, something which Mr. Sanchez had refused in the post-April election talks. The two leaders said details would come later and did not comment further. The speculation is that they'll try to get other parties on board, including Ciudadanos, Mas País and the Basque Nationalist Party.